Hey guys, welcome back to Diana and Marie TV. Thank you so much for tuning in to another episode of Them Bulls. If you haven't already subscribed, hit that subscribe button so you will miss out on any new content from my channel. So in this video, we will be discussing Jonte Porter as a second round option for the Chicago Bulls to pick. We will be breaking down some of his strengths, his weaknesses, and to see how he will fit on the current Chicago Bulls team. So Jonte Porter is a 6'11 forward who played at Missouri and he weighs around 230 pounds. While in the school, he averaged 9.6.8 rebounds and 2.2 assists. While playing in college, Jonte had became known for his three-point shooting and being able to use his size to score over defenders. His ability to find open looks on the court and knowing when to pass the ball has made him very appealing to a lot of teams in this year's draft. He's not afraid of contact and he's a very unselfish player. He has been drawing a lot of comparisons to Nikola Jokic and if the Bulls were to pick him in the second round at 38, then he would be a great player to have to come off the bench. He also averaged 2.7 blocks, 1.4 steals, and forced a lot of turnovers. Watching Jonte play in school, it was really evident that in every game he was working to improve on his jumper and making sure that he could score from anywhere on the court. Now, of course, when it comes to weaknesses, we have to discuss that Jonte Porter tore his ACL twice and had an MCL injury also. Jonte is not an explosive player and does not have the athleticism that makes him stand out and I believe it's because of the injuries. If he didn't get injured, then his draft stock would probably be higher, but it would be a risk for the Bulls to pick him or any team for that matter because unfortunately, it really looks like he's injury prone. But I think his playmaking ability and seeing how effective he is at scoring and being able to play him as a four or even a center also makes him appealing since he was able to do both this school. So that is it for this video. Make sure you guys leave your thoughts and opinions about Jonte Porter. Do you guys think it would be a risk if the Bulls did decide to pick him at number 38 even though he has had a lot of injuries? Let me know in the comments below. I will see you guys in my next video. Thanks so much for watching.